as people. Over time, when we age, we lose our inner glow. This is a common thing that people do. Most often, we miss holding our little glow. The light that glows out from the inside of us. And when we miss the glow, we try to do many things to see the glow again. We try things and attend spirit workshops or take out bank loans for metaphysical Amazon rainforest vacations or we stay inside of our homes and try domestic remedies where we stand in a dark room before a mirror to wait and watch for the glow to peek out from behind our ribs and the glow sometimes it looks like a little aquarium inside of you with bright white fish and neon coral and sometimes it looks like a little Christmas tree inside of a little decorated house inside of a little snow globe and the snow globe plays music but the music is light and sometimes it looks like the little bravery that comes from every new leaf that appears after the last snow and sometimes it looks like a little neon hot dogs sign hanging above a little baseball game on a little earth inside of a different little snow globe one good way to find your glow is to cover yourself with a blanket a blanket that can block out any light that might try to shine on you and make your exterior dark and ready so you can try to hold every glow that you can imagine and then every glow that you have yet to imagine and now you are asleep and ready for another dream with your dream guide friend this is the blanket dream you begin in the bathroom looking over your bathtub where you started the construction of a small model Kenyon the therapist who you visit in your dreams for an hour every Tuesday night suggested you should construct a companion canyon because your therapist knows the value of human and canyon relationships and noted your lack of canyon understanding you have spent months wandering through other dreamscapes collecting rocks and small floor and even smaller fauna putting those items into your inventory carrying them back to your apartment in order to build the small canyon in your bathtub and as full as your bathtub is with canyon you know it will take many more months of collecting and arranging and rearranging the materials of the canyon until it feels like a living and breathing canyon and then after the canyon feels alive you must discover the best possible name for your companion canyon at this moment discovering the best possible name feels difficult so you pull out a blue blanket from your inventory and cover yourself with the blanket and hide all sight of your body from the canyon now you look like a perfectly calm and blue ghost of the sky above the canyon you say to your 
companion, Kenyon. Now, it is time for rain. And you, wrinkle, your blue, sky, ghost, blanket. So the wrinkles, grow shadows to darken, the blanket, to give you a stormy, look. You say, to your, companion, Kenyon. Maybe, a thousand, years, worth, of rain, will help. And then, you bend, down and turn on, the shower and water, sprays out from the shower, head, down, onto, the companion, canyon and outside, of your, bathtub because, you did not, close, the shower, curtain and your, stormy, sky, ghost, blanket, darkens, with water, spray and you look, like, the first, stars, of the universe, like hot, match, tips, singeing through, a paper, atmosphere, to shine through, to the, canyon, below in the water, in the bathtub, pushes, and churns, against, the collection, of rocks. They are rocks, which, would never, normally, meet in the, geology of their own, dreamscapes. But you have, collected the rocks, and line, the rocks, along the edge, of the tub, and stacked, the rocks, on top, of other rocks, so that, rain and, time, may meld, and grind, the rocks, into a living, and breathing, companion, canyon, and in the rain, the small flora and even smaller, fauna, cling, to each other and float, where the shower water, creates pools, and then, flood zones and you do not feel worried, about their fates, because, you are, the ghost, of the sky and because, you are, under, your blue blanket and because, your eyes, and ears, are covered and because, you know, there are lots, of small flora, and even smaller, fauna, to collect, from other dreams to replace, whatever, does not, survive the shower. The shower runs, for a few minutes and when that feels, like a thousand miniature, canyon, years worth of rain, you turn, the shower off. And like, how it feels, when you lock, your keys, inside of your car. You feel, that feeling for the shower, and the bathtub because, it is the only bathtub, in your apartment and thanks, to the blue sky, of ghost, blanket. You are wearing, you can smell, your body and it is, the smell, your body makes. When you have not, had a shower, in two weeks. Because, that is how long, you have spent, building, your miniature, companion, Kenyon. Often, in dreams, we never take time, to smell ourselves, and when, we put ourselves, in a position, to smell, ourselves in a dream. This comes about, because, in our waking life, we are still unsure, about the purchase, of a new soap. A soap, we purchased, to become a new smell, in dreams, and in, the waking world. Our smells, are important. Particular, smells, can reduce stress, while other smells, can increase, our ability, to attract money. Perhaps, since you are, examining, your dream smell, when you wake up, you should, examine, your waking smell, determine, if your smell, is doing, the most, a smell, can possibly do for you or, if you, are having trouble, in the world, perhaps, it is time, to travel, to a smell store and talk, to a scent artist, who is a professional, that designs, smells for people, based upon, their own, chemical, composition, and emotional needs. Here, in the dream world, it is easy, 
to remedy your smell. All you must do is take a bath. But your bathtub is occupied by your project, Kenyon. So you walk to your kitchen sink and when you remove your blue blanket, you are reminded that the kitchen sink is occupied. Your sink is occupied by a model apartment building. The model apartment building is a model of the apartment building from your childhood. Your therapist, who you visit once a week on Tuesday nights thought it would be a good exercise in letting go of your past to see the apartment building from your childhood decay and disintegrate because you constructed the model apartment building from your childhood from sugar and when you want to watch it decay and disintegrate you pour faucet water from the sink faucet onto the apartment building and watch it melt and in a way the exercise has been helpful because the top three floors of the apartment building are gone still you have two more floors to disintegrate before you melt your childhood apartment and the replicas of your furnishings in that apartment which are also made of sugar and then there are five more floors and a basement to melt then your sink will be clear and your memory of your childhood will be clear but you do not want to look at your model apartment building you want to use the sink you take off your blanket and cover up the sink and the model apartment building so all you think of when you look at the space of blue is a swimming pool that feels clean and warm what does this part of your dream mean sometimes as people when we want to display our gratitude we displace a lot of water and when we displace a lot of water we spread out a towel on the ground to soak up all of the water we have displaced think about ways in which you have displaced water but do not think of the water as water the water you are displacing can be air or emotion most of the time we are displacing our emotions in the air and emotions have a way of making others damp but not in a real and wet way not that kind of dampness it is an emotional dampness have you ever been sad and noticed how others must avoid you in order to keep from being sad as well this is exactly when you should place a towel on the ground to absorb your displaced emotions but not really a towel or a blanket maybe say a prayer or light a candle and if you cannot think of a prayer or light a candle imagine the feeling of a prayer candle in your mind and that action thought will protect others from the emotions you are displacing you remember the smell of yourself and still want to bathe but your bathtub and kitchen sink are full of therapeutic projects you leave your house and you pull out a leaf patterned blanket from your inventory and wear it like a cape everyone will think you are just another tree going on an afternoon walk because you do not want anyone to stop you and bother you and ask you for bus fare or even a donation to the dream town community marching band everyone knows 
a tree does not carry a wallet and you begin walking on a road in the direction of the nearest store a part of you wishes you were headed somewhere with a character who is mostly just you but outside of you as in a version of you with the same appearance and life experience but took a different approach to your life and as you walk with this character who is a version of you and you will feel them be very quiet as if they are receded far into their mind and thinking so it will feel like you are walking alone in ways but this character will be far inside their mind thinking about going to work at night because their job is to dive into dark water and come up from the water only to dive back down into the water again and this character that is a version of you had you followed a different path will be very meditative upon the job in the night ahead and you will be traveling with this character on something like a road walking on something like a path it is made of dirt and dry and you can tell at one point it was covered by gravel but rain and foot traffic pushed the gravel down into the dirt sometimes in dreams you find yourself daydreaming and as unlikely as that seems it is very likely and common to find yourself daydreaming even when it is night and often in such daydreams you will think about becoming an actor you will think about becoming a character much like the character you travel with you will think about becoming a different version of yourself and maybe the character you become will be a person who was abducted from their whole life by a job they do not understand because your character has the important trait of trying to stay alive and one way to stay alive is to keep a job even if your character does not understand the job and sometimes when your character is not working or not understanding why they are working your character will pay attention to the words of politicians and maybe your character will not understand all of the words the politicians use your character will understand the moans and screams of the politicians moans and screams about how everything in your life is wrong moans and screams about how everything outside of your life conspires against your character moans and screams about how there are people in the world that threaten your existence people in the world that want to erase your character and take away the job your character does not understand so your character has less work and less ability to live and so the character you daydream about daydreams about being another character and maybe the character your character daydreams about is not a person but a dog a dog that wears a magic hat and the magic hat will help the dog speak to people so that the dog when wearing the magic hat can calm down all of the people and politicians in the world by saying things like look at that bug end look at that leaf end look at that balloon on the tree 
that says, it's a boy. I wonder if the tree wants to tell everyone they're a boy or if the tree had a boy or if the tree just bought the balloon to give to a sky because the sky just had a boy. Regardless, I think that we should congratulate the tree. You are still on the path to the store wearing the leaf pattern blanket from your inventory like a cape thinking that everyone will think you are just another tree going on an afternoon walk and then you collide with the path that is you bump into something on the path that looks like the path and you say oh and the path says oh and then before your very eyes a man appears he pulls a dirt colored blanket from his face and says excuse me I did not realize a tree would be walking on this path and you untie the leaf pattern blanket from around your neck and then say excuse me I did not realize a path would be walking on this path and the man says to you what is a tree doing walking around I know of trees that stand around forests or sometimes outside of bedroom windows like perverts but never have I seen a tree just walk around and before you can explain your reasoning the man covers himself with a dirt covered blanket and disappears often in dreams like in the waking life we wear the wrong outfit to an occasion perhaps you are concerned about the impression you will make on other people because first impressions are so important in human and human relationships often it is not your lack of fashion education that prevents you from wearing the correct outfit often income inability prevents you from purchasing the correct outfit one good way to overcome your income inability is to host a hands-on money manifestation party invite all of your friends and co-workers tell each friend to bring a friend and ask everyone to bring five dollars make it fun and give everyone a colored pencil and then have your guests draw on the walls ask your guests to draw their personal animal symbol of wealth place bets on who will draw a kangaroo first you will need a trap to catch the money creatures draw circles around every animal tell each guest to give you five dollars or you will ruin their future money success tell each guest that you will erase their personal animal symbol of wealth most importantly have fun because it is your party you are still on the path to the store but you are no longer wearing the leaf pattern blanket from your inventory like a cape you begin thinking that it was a mistake to look like just another tree going on an afternoon walk because when you turn around your house is just behind you the sunlight of the day has faded and now it is night time you see the kitchen window of your house the kitchen window above the sink where your therapeutic model of the apartment building from your youth sits and see that you left the light on and you see inside the kitchen and you see the therapeutic model of the apartment building from your youth growing and maybe growing is not the correct word but the apartment building does increase in height with new floors and width with new windows and then rises from the sink and moves out of your view and the growing and building an expanding apartment building from your childhood is an embodiment of the past and it has risen to find you 
you walk to the kitchen window to look for the apartment building. The building walks around your kitchen. It opens your refrigerator. It takes out a carton of orange juice. It drinks all of your orange juice. But really, the orange juice spills out of the windows of the apartment building to the floor, and you think about finding your mop. The building walks around your house. It opens up and empties your closets. It swipes your bookshelves clear of books. It topples your furniture and unmakes your bed and when the apartment building of your youth sees you looking in from the kitchen window. The building walks toward you and you feel the fear that your past wants to disturb the organization of your limbs and organs. You open your inventory and find a blanket pattern with race cars and throw it over your head and you become dozens of race cars with headlights beaming and driving in every direction and then in ovals and then in figure eight loops and the engines of your race cars roar you off away from your house away from the apartment building of your youth away from the companion canyon in your bathtub and into the night down the road which is also a path of dirt and into the trees and the many race cars of you cannot race car very well among the trees and the many race cars of you crash into the trees and become wreckage in the many race cars of you become flaming and smoking and honking wreckage and then like the morning sun a collection of monks discover your wreckage they remove the race car pattern blanket from your body and then carry you to their monastery and there they heal you and many months pass and you recover from your injuries and the monks at the monastery give you a new name they call you handsome head because after they shaved your head they discovered your head was very handsome and then after the monks give you a new name they give you simple blankets to wear so you look like them and you become a simple monk and many months pass and sometimes in those months you wear two or three simple blankets at the same time and become a double or triple simple monk and sometimes it is your turn to feed the monastery turtle and when it is your turn to feed the monastery turtle you pretend the turtle is your personal companion turtle and you tell the turtle stories about your old life and one story that you tell the turtle is a story about an apartment building that wanders the earth looking for all of its former tenants because the apartment building is too full of empty rooms and the turtle listens to the story and eats in a way that makes you think that the turtle likes the story and another story that you tell the turtle is a story about a small canyon in a bathtub in the small canyon in a bathtub never learned how to canyon because one day the canyon's companion became a ghost like the sky and floated away and the turtle listens to the story and eats in a way that makes you think that the turtle likes the story and another story that you tell the turtle is a story about a race car driver that wrecked in a forest and the race car driver wrecked so hard that the driver forgot their name and forgot their face and forgot their home and spent their time wearing blankets and feeding a turtle and at the end of that story you tell the turtle like many stories that seem like dreams I have sometimes had I am unsure how the story like a dream will end and the turtle listens to the story and eats in a way that makes you think that the turtle likes the story and now you are awake and ready for another day this has been the blanket dream
with your dream guide, friend. Dream guides are written and recorded by Chad Redden.